Let's create a rating system within Google Sheets where as you change your scores given, automatically that rating system adjusts and updates. Now the way we're going to do that is by using a combination of two formulas. Now if you would like to follow along, there will be a link in the description below. Click on that, make a copy of this file, and you can follow along with the exact same data I've got here. You can use this yourself or share it with your students and have them play with this. Now here you can see I've got a number of book titles on the left hand side. I have the author information and the books have been given a score. Now automatically on the right hand side, this score is represented visually using those stars. So let's jump into the DIY sheet and let's rebuild this. Now you can see here on the right hand side, we will need two formulas. We need the char pulls up a Unicode character. We've talked about that in the video linked in the cards at the top, so you can go ahead and watch that video as well. Now the second we need for this is the repetition. So we're going to use the REPT repped in Google Sheets. So let's go ahead and start with our first character. Let's find a character that represents that rating system, a star. Now in order to do that, we're going to have to type equals char, open up that char with our brackets and then we need the number of a star. So let's go back to the website Unicode search, also linked in this document. So if you want to find a copy of that document, you can find it in the description, Unicode search. And let's search for a star. There we go, we get all the stars and I quite like this one here, the black star. This has the ID 9733. So let's copy that number and let's pop it in there and close our brackets. Okay, we now have our star, we have a single star but we don't want to manually copy paste this and we want the formula to automatically match our score. So what we can do next is we take the same formula and we're going to add a little bit to this. Before we pull in that char or that character, we're going to type wrapped. Now, as you can see here, this formula takes in two arguments. The first is the text to repeat. Well, we know that that's our character. So we're going to comma. And then it asks a number of repetitions Now we could manually type in number four. But if we want to automate this, then we are going to ask Google Sheets to get that information from this cell right here, C3. And then we can close our formula. This automatically takes that information and turns it into a repeated string. So let's go ahead and now pull this down and it will automatically apply that same formula to all rows selected. If I was to change this rating from a four into a one, you will see it automatically updates in the column E. I'm going to return that to four because this is an excellent book. Now, if you found this helpful, make sure to subscribe to the channel, share it with someone who might find this useful. And don't forget the files that I use are linked in the description below. Now go ahead and watch the next Google Sheets video.